This video will demonstrate how to view and edit images in CloudKO with our new algorithm, CSAI. First, I will go through my job in the viewer and decide which images I need to fix and which ones can be skipped. With our old algorithm, you had to edit every image where the subject was wearing green, but now with CSAI, the green will be retained in the clothing. Here we can see that all the green has been retained on the result, and if we look at the mask, there is no white on the subject showing transparency, so this image can be skipped by pressing the left arrow on your keyboard to mark it as don't use mask. This next image is also perfect as is, and this one too, and even this green grad knocked out perfectly. Our new algorithm is also better at removing background wrinkles, dirt, and shadows. Here we can see that all the wrinkles and shadows have been removed automatically and the green in the clothing has been retained, so we can skip this image as well. Out of all the images you upload, less than 5% might need to be fixed, so now I'm going to show you the types of images that may require editing. It is rare, but sometimes a piece of background green may remain on the result. I will select this image by pressing the right arrow on my keyboard to show you what to do if this happens. Once in a while, there may be a bit of green missing on the result, which will appear on the mask as white. This can easily be fixed in the Cloud KO editor. Really dark greens may sometimes have areas that appear brown, gray, or bluish on the result, but may not show up as white on the mask. These can also be fixed in the editor. Sometimes, green spill could remain on the result, like on these light gray pants. This can easily be fixed with Cloud KO's Smart Correction tool. If spill is very bad, it may lead to transparency on the result, which we can also easily fix in the editor. Finally, sheer material or fabric or objects with holes can sometimes have background stuck in them. This can also be fixed using the Smart Correction tool. I will now open my selected images in the editor to show you how to fix them. In the editor, there are three tools available, the brush, the wand, and the lasso, and there are two layers. The green screen correction layer which we are always on by default, is used to hide and show green on the green mask. And the background retouching layer is used to remove background green, wrinkles, and shadows that remain on the result. To remove this piece of background green, I will first switch to the background retouching layer. I will then use the wand to select it and press F11 to hide the green within my selection. To save an image and go to the next one, just press F8. To quickly identify where on an image the transparency was, just press C on your keyboard to flip through a series of background colors. To put the green back in the subject's clothing, I will switch my brush to green and then just paint over the transparent area. I will do the same thing on this image to fill in the brown spots with green. And then just use the wand tool and the F11 action to get rid of the background green I painted on. This image also has a bit of transparency on the shirt, so I will fix that with the green brush and then show you how to edit the green spill. To get rid of spill, I will enter Smart Correction mode and then when the cursor changes to blue, sample an area of the pants containing no spill. I will then use the green brush to paint over the spill to remove it. This image had some spill on the stool, causing it to become transparent. In this case, after entering Smart Correction mode and sampling the gray stool, I can either paint while holding Alt or select the stool with the wand tool and then press Control Delete to fill in the transparency. This final image has some background stuck in the transparent material of the dress. To get rid of it, I will access Smart Correction mode, sample the blue skirt, and then just paint over the green to remove it. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell so you can stay up to date on all of our new products and features. Thanks for watching.